revolt early. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we saw these guys at the Chew and Brew, or the Brew and Chew in Chino a couple weeks ago, which we released a video on. I had their Kolsch. It's a supply store yeah. plus a uh, brewery in the back. Okay, check it out. There's a place called, there's, a, there's an alert called uh, Purple Alert. Yes, you can bring your kids here. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, people gotta know. People gotta know. Yeah, I've been eating it pretty much the whole entire time. <laughs> First one we're going to tackle is going to be the Simcoe IPA. And good, next man. one, the Vicarious. Hoppy Red. 6.4% oh, cool. on this one. It's a hoppy. Oh. St. Sam's Porter. Oh. Nice. I sound really low. Give it a try now that my palate is nice and buttered up. <laughs> this is how you get an accurate taste. All right, well. Down the hatch. Take like a bushel of pines and smell them. <laughs> I mean, if you're familiar with the Simcoe, uh, Simcoe hops. Or yeah, there's a very specific smell to it, mm -hmm. too. Sniff is that. <sighs> All right, Drop next one. <laughs> By Curious. Either hoppy or Tourette or maybe a bit of both. It's like you can smell the hoppiness and like, yeah. the, like you said, that imperial red kind of, like that woody, mm. syrupy kind of. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's like taking a... Uh, jar of maple syrup and pouring it on a burnt log. Exactly. Dude. That's, that's so funny. Yeah. It's, like, it's like you marinated the log in syrup. <laughs> and the hatch. I mean, I don't really have to do that little rat thing, but it's just a habit, so it, it doesn't enhance the taste. That's a very cool blend. I like the fact that it, like, it Come, like, hits your palate like an IPA, but then it kind of sweeps it with that red. Got a nice view outside, blue skies, smoggy mountains. Smoggy mountains. <laughs> Sam's Porter. We got a Porter, 5.2, huh? Slightly darker though, huh? Just, just a little bit. Slightly oh. darker, but still lighter. And um, it's uh, less than IBUs and Less than alcohol volume. So. This one, this one smells kind of like uh, like meat. It's got that meaty smell to it. You know what I'm talking about? Like that marinated meat, meat smell. Okay, so once you said marinated, I was like, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> like a I'm like smell. Chuck Steak. Like I don't know if I can smell that right <laughs> off the bat. <laughs> oh my yeah. God. The soy sauce yeah. for sure. It's like the soy sauce blend, huh? Oh, yeah. dude. This will go perfect with sushi. Yeah, it does. That's crazy. It's like it actually would be perfect with the sesame. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Sesame and rice. Okay, so one. we've so got the Renaissance ice home. Ready to give this one a whirl. Ready to give this one a whirl. Down the hatch. The hatch. That. There's like an apple. Yeah. <laughs> Take me back to my third, my my our days in grade school. Where we used to drink apple juice by the carton. Uh, yeah, I think I, I, like I think the favorite it. here for sure. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, good job, Nicole. Awesome. That concludes two bros, one, one brewery. brewery for a Saturday afternoon. If you are a brewery, actually check this place out for supplies because they are a supply company too. But for two bros, one brewery today, check us out on. Instagram. Instagram, yeah. so monkey underscore chuckles. And uh, of course, YouTube. 
Mookie Juggles Productions, and then we got Facebook Inside the IE, that's Inland Empire, and uh, Twitter, Monkey Juggles, no underscore. So, anyway, support your local brewery. Yeah, uh, look drink for the local. Seal. Seek, seek, or search the seal. Hashtag. Remember that hashtag search the seal. Uh, so that's it for another episode of Two Bros on Brewery Revolt, Revolt Brewing in Montclair, Cali. If you want us to check out our place. Let us know. When you have kids, um, it's hard to pawn them off to grandparents sometimes. So <laughs> if you, you want to find a place to get a little wanna... buzz because you have your kids. <laughs> kids screaming, yelling, you need to get a drink. Yeah. You need to get away for a little bit. Come, Come to your brewery. <laughs>